Tiger Rock in Pango Island enjoys good reviews for its natural settings. We decided to check them out, getting away from the hustle and bustle of Kuala Lumpur. The journey from Kuala Lumpur by car is around 3 hours, and then a 30 minutes ferry ride from Lumut to Pango Island. Mohan, the manager and person in charge of Tiger Rock, met us at the jetty and drove us to Tiger Rock, located in the southern part of the island, and the journey took about 10 minutes. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. This is Nandini. You're going to be in a good hands of herself. With welcoming drinks from Nadini, we were introduced to the facilities at this place which we will call home for the next few days. That's what Mohan wanted his guests to feel instead of being in a resort or hotel. We stayed at the Hill House which came with a dedicated small swimming pool and realization area under the thick tropical tree canopy. relaxation and spending quality time together as our main agenda, checking out the place and lazing around Tiger Rock, various spots within natural settings came naturally. There are a total of eight rooms in Tiger Rock. During our three nights stay, there were another two couples beside us, giving everyone sufficient space and privacy. The swimming pool next to the main house is simply idyllic, and that was the spot that we spent our evenings before dinner. in a day are included, cooked by the talented Bhavani, wife of Mohan. They are delicious yet simple Malaysian food from Indian to Chinese and Malay's cuisine. Every meal is very satisfying. <laughs> We took a short 20 minutes hike through the woods to Pantai Teluk Segadas, a white sandy beach at the southern tip of Panko Island. The beach is not accessible by roads and that attracted us because it would not be crowded like other stretches of beach with commercial activities. Discovered the beach was occupied with campers from UPM. 
They were there for 10 days as part of their teaching degree syllabus. Mohan encouraged us to take an island tour as part of our itinerary and we did that on a two-hour ride on one of those pink vans where we were driven around the island clockwise dropping by Panko Island various tourist attractions. The weather was not pleasant in the morning with intermittent showers. We spent some time checking out the streets of Panko town as well. We thoroughly enjoyed our stay and immersed ourselves totally into the natural setting and went home with a refreshed and rejuvenated mind.